you guys here with another Adron Airsoft review. This time it is my homemade tactical vest. Um, now this is another solution rather than making like a cardboard armor or something because this works even better. I've taken a uh, UTG M3 shotgun blast point blank to the back with this stuff and you just barely feel it. It just feels like a little push. No sting at all whatsoever, but um, yeah, this is made out of a backpack, like this, um, uh, preferably with the, uh, I don't know if you can see this, but it's got um, this pouch right here in the back got an extra pouch. We'll get to this extra pouch part later. But mainly, you need the back right here and the straps. So, here is your thing. There's the back. So, what you, what you want to do is cut off everything except for these straps, like the straps and the back pad. Cut, just cut everything off right around here, okay? We'd save it. Then we're gonna take some foam insulation, and I put it right around the neck piece, kind of for extra um, neck padding, because it sort of cut in right here after a while. Um, got two straps. Um, take your two straps and sew them on like right here, and then they're gonna clip on as like chest support so it, it doesn't wobble up here and then take these parts these two clips sew them on down at the bottom as sort of a belt so you're gonna have two different uh, clips um, here's an extra pocket and here's the adjustment straps um, so yeah that's about it for how to make it but then there's lots of extra features. Let me put it on. It's pretty quick. Just so you can see. Um, yeah, it fits pretty nicely. Um, and then you can put on attachments like this holster right here, um, just unstrap it, and you can put it on this top one right here, and there you got a holster, and then you can take like your uh, Colt 1911 Springer, and put it right there, take your extra pouch, put your magazine in. And there you go, you got this. So then you can just unclip it, pull it up, shoot, and then once you're done, just put it back. And uh, yeah, and then another attachment, which is also homemade. It's like a drop pouch, but it can be used for anything actually. Um, it is just a, um, Pencil, pencil case, case with some with velcro, some velcro and, and, and a, a strap. strap. So, so it's got a little strap here for extra support, and then velcro to keep it together. Find out a nice little folding pattern that helps it stay together fine. Uh, yeah, here I just it was actually orange. And then I sprayed it green. Um, I put two pieces of Velcro here and here. So then you can fold it in half. And then fold it twice. And then the pieces line up. And they lock together. So then you can just unfold it pretty quick. And then you got your zipper pouch up here. So you can unzip it. And then like stick a used mag, just drop it in there, 
And then, um, right here is more Velcro for a strap. So you can strap it on to your belt or something. And then once you're done, you can just zip it up. And then you're good to go. And then refold it once you fill your uh, mags up in it. Uh, put them back in your pouches. So yeah, that's how to make a simple homemade uh, tactical vest. All right, and then you can also, you can take, I remember when I was talking about the extra pad in there for that pocket, you can take it, cut it out, you have this, and then you can unclip it right there, and then just sort of place it here under the strap, and then click it, and then sort of tuck it under your, under your belt. And then there you go, you have protection from the front and the back. So yeah, you can do that. And it actually makes it a little bit tighter, so this holds on a little bit better. It's a little bit hot, but uh, once the adrenaline's pumping, then you won't even notice. Subscribe and check out my, uh, my channel over there. And then down there, comment uh, and rate. Tell me what you think. Any questions, uh, shoot away. And uh, if you make something like this, I want to see it, leave it as a video response. So uh, see it, keep airsofting.